hello guys welcome back in the laravel video tutorial and in this video we are going to start with the latest version of laravel which is the 5.7 and this release uh, some days ago so we can let's start with that so in this video we are going to learn how we can install the laravel with the composer so guys if you don't have the composer then don't worry uh, the link of composer how to install the composer is given in the description you can uh, watch from the here and learn from the here so now just I'm going this is a Laravel official site and I'm going to click on the documentation so uh, before that I made that rule for 5.6 also but the uh, my viewer saying that make the video, video for 5.7 also uh, I want to tell you that uh, guys if you are the new in the Laravel and if you are going to learn the latest version of Laravel, then you don't need to learn the previous uh, Laravel version like 5.6, uh, 4 or 5 and etc. Because these are the just enhancements of the Laravel, not the changes like uh, they are not going to change in the uh, coding standards and uh, routings, controllers, code and syntactically, they are not going to, they are just uh, upgrading something so first of all let's uh, see how we can install this and we, during the installation we will uh, discuss some more things so first of all uh, you have to check that is composer installed or not for that there is a simple command just type composer so you can see that the composer is installed here all right that's fine so now you can go where you want to install your laravel so let's say i want to install in the where www html and i'm going to make a directory here if you want let's say mkdir uh, lara okay just like laravel all right and just write m cd laravel all right so for here uh, you can go to the documentation and just uh, you can write go uh, scroll down and you can copy this composer global required laravel installer so just type this and if you don't have composer i already told you that you can find the description uh, box uh, I link I post the uh, link of this video in the description box you can learn from here so yes so first of all uh, just it will take some time in within time I'm we can uh, check out some more things that what is the coming within the Laravel new so if I'm going to put here master or uh, Laravel 5.7 then these are the same thing because they they both are the new so uh, let me check where is the latest thing in here so yes these are the release notes and these are the upgrade guides also if you want to say that if you want to check that so you can see that how we can install and uh, upgrade the all the things if you have the uh, old version we will discuss all these things in the latest version uh, in the next videos but uh, let's go through with this the uh, uh, version we can say that the release note we can see that so here they put the name of laravel nova and they put some uh, new things with the email verification and uh, guest user gates policies and all these things paginator links and this we will discuss in this all these things so uh, let's check okay so it's installing so I'm going to put this video for the pause so that you cannot uh, waste uh, because you don't we don't need to waste the time or to see the this command line so I'll be get back to you that whenever it's going to install and after that we have to uh, do one more thing let's just click on here uh, we need to uh, do one more command one or two more more commands to uh, this just installation we we need to one or more one or two more commands to inst uh, to configure the installation so we will come back to you within a few moments so 
All right. So we uh, just just check that the uh, installer is completed now. So now we can use this command Laravel new blog and it will give you the new project with the name of with the name of Laravel new uh, with the name of blog actually. So just run this command and this is also going sometime. So I'm going to again post this video. Oh yeah, welcome back. Uh, okay so here you can see that the project is installed now and for check that is it properly installed or not you can check that with the php partition command so okay so what did i okay so first of all i have to go in the blog folder and then we can check the php artisan all right so here is a light much many commands number of commands so for the run i can use php artisan serve and it will tell me telling me that uh, uh, my project is running on this link so just check that all right so this is working fine so for open this so let's start open so just po after the posing video i will start the v's the complete first session so i think it's a good session so just open it and go to the where i have to go to the computer all right just go to the where www html and laravel and here is my blog project so all right so here is a project is ready and you can see that we have everything here env file and application controller http all these things so uh, we will talk the other things in the next next video session so thanks guys thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe our channel stay with the touch and if you have any kind of suggestion you can ask me in the comment box also thanks guys thanks for watching this video